Hi, this is day three of um, JD living the life, my version, working the life. I'm trying to work for Jermaine Dupree, and I'm looking for Jermaine Dupree, and I've been sending videos to Jermaine Dupree and messaging Jermaine Dupree because I'm trying to get in contact with him so he can um, allow me to work for him, so he can hire me as his personal assistant. Why I chose Jermaine Dupree? I chose Jermaine Dupree because. I feel like he is a hard worker and that he is about his business. He has many successes. He has a, a music for, I mean, an ear for music, and he knows right. Like what he what he sees, you know, happening when it happens, it's something good. It's not like his work is weak. You know, working with people like Usher, Mariah Carey, um, TLC, um, Jay Z, just different people, just different. You know lay back chill nice singing people because you know you can throw in a mariah carey you know song and you'd be like wow mariah carey has a nice voice and her songs that she has sung has been pretty good has been great actually along with um usher i've loved usher since he came out and i mean people try to say usher hasn't been having good songs but his his last one, Here I Stand, I like that. I like a lot of songs on that album. So, I mean, every time Usher comes out with something, it's 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 gonna be good. It's it's good. So, um I'm very tired right now, but this is all for Jermaine Dupree. And um I just got off of work. I had work from eight to five today and for some reason I'm very, very sleepy and tired. I normally, you know, feel like physically tired, but I'm like a mental and, you know, in the inside, I feel very, very tired. So, um, forgive me if I'm stuttering or, you know, doing this basically. Um, a lot of things that I, you know, I said, well, maybe I'm a... I'm going to just do like research on Jermaine Dupri, you know, just let other people know maybe things that I didn't even know and things that I do know. Like, I didn't know Jermaine's full name was Jermaine Dupri Marwin, Marden, Marden, sorry, excuse me, correction, Marden. And um, I'm actually looking at the biography. Um, and basically, J Jermaine Dupri has... Um, Sorry. Okay, and um, basically, Jermaine Dupri is just basically a, just a calm, chilled, business type man, a person that I would love to just work with. It's just a connection I feel like I had with him, and I haven't even met him. You know, that's that's deep. You know, as a, a person, for someone to feel connected to you and they don't even know you. You know, and people was like, "Why? Well, Why won't you? Why you didn't pick somebody like P Diddy and the assistant thing?" I'm like. That's because that's P. Diddy and that's his assistant thing. Like, big ups to P. Diddy. I love P. Diddy. But, no, it's JD, it's JD that I want to work with. And I just like his vibe. I like what he got going on. I like his successes. I like what he has been doing. And I said, well, well what, how, how more can I get close to this man? You know, I just started reading about things that maybe I didn't even know. And, um, you know, just different things like his birthday and working with Criss Cross and you know escaping and I knew he was working with Jacket Edge and Bow Wow and DeBrat. DeBrat was like him and DeBrat was like this. I mean I knew that stuff and so it's just just little things different projects that I didn't know that Jermaine Dupri worked on you know I find out that he worked on that song and I'm like wow I like that song no wonder because I like Jermaine Dupri and he wrote it or he you know uh, produced it or you know just whatever and so um Jermaine Dupree got like a little hot thing going on right now he's very you know a person that is behind the scenes but but not behind the scenes because he's done so much and done so so much into other people's music like they probably wouldn't even be what they are if it wasn't for that little bit that Jermaine Dupree put in or that that half that Jermaine and Pre done put in, you know, he put in a lot of stuff to make the artists that we see now. And, you know, we ought to applaud 
those type of people that put into other people to make them, you know, to make us, you know, be attracted to them, you know. Like Usher, Usher got his own swag, his own little thing. Other people probably contribute to Usher and Jermaine Dupri is one of those people. And like when he did, um, you know, it says Burn and Confessions Part 2, like, I love that song. I love, I could listen to Burn and just sing it right now and to this day. And I think Burn came out 2004, 2005, around the time when I was graduating. So I could listen to Burn now and still love it. So, I mean, that tells, that tells you a lot about a person and what they do and everything like that. So, um, hopefully I am going to send this video to Jermaine so he can see it and just basically let him know that I'm going to make these videos every single day. I'm going to be dedicated to this because this is something that I really want to do. I really want to work for him. And I really want to be a part of his movement of everything that he's doing, his successes. And I really just want to just help him out as his personal assistant. And he might say he don't want one. But I'm telling him he's he, he, want, he want me to be his assistant and to be a part of his um, projects that he has upcoming. And I want to help him with whatever it is that he needs help with. You know, the... He's done so much for people, so much, you know what I mean? He gets paid, but he done so much, just the heart of it, not just throwing anything at anybody or, you know, just, he takes his time. I could tell he's a man who takes his time, who's a thinker. Like, I remember when uh, Aaliyah passed away, I didn't even know he worked with Aaliyah. I thought that, you know, it was just, um... R. Kelly, then it went past on to Missy, but it went through Jermaine Dupri before it went through Missy to Missy. So, I mean, Jermaine Dupri does a lot of things, and I love Aaliyah. Like that was my girl. So, um, Jermaine Dupri did a lot of a lot of things, and um, you know, a lot of things that we don't even know about. And so, I just basically want to work with him. It's been my dream to do something in um, entertainment. That has been my whole thing since I was a little girl. I always wanted to do something, you know. I'm not a big singer, but, you know, I try to sing a tune or two, you know what I'm saying? But I'm not really, but it's something that I enjoy being around. Acting is something I enjoy being around. Dancing is something I love, enjoy doing or being around or, you know, um, writing songs. It's something I enjoy being around. And I'm like, I said, what is a job? that I can do where I can be in the atmosphere of it but not but not you know really doing it because that's not that's not my thing but help support it in some way and I'm like well I'm, I'm I, I go to college for business and um, management right now um, I haven't finished it or anything like that but this what I want to do assisting is basically business you know it's the business atmosphere I'm a business type woman I feel and um I got my work shirt on right now, <laughs> but uh, I'm a business type woman, and so I just feel like it would just, it I, this would be a good job for me, basically, and um, I'm willing to do whatever it takes to get to that point, and I'm not going to lie, when I seen P. Diddy's assistant um, show he had, I was like, wow, could I see myself doing that? I'm like, yeah. I could. I could see myself doing that. And so I'm like, yeah, he has nothing to worry about. You know, I could really, you know, just help him out with that. And I really, 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 really want this job. And I just hope that he can find a spot or something for me to do. If it's stacking papers in the office, I'll do it. If it's running down the street, around the corner, to get some blank CDs, I'll do it. If you want me to do anything, just like go anywhere and run some errands for you that you're not able to run. If you're in Atlanta and you want me to fly out to LA to get some stuff or to do some things, I'll do that. If I'm in New York, you know, wherever it is, go to back. To your hometown to send somebody some gifts or flowers or whatever like I do that that's what I want to do it's for a good cause and it's for a good person so 
Jermaine, I'm hoping that you're watching this, that you take the time out and you really consider and that you pray about it before you receive it. But honestly, I, I feel like I can I could be a, a great asset to your to your career and to your your label and just to your people around you, you know, your artists that you you know, you produce and everything. So I think I could really help out and Please, please, please write me back and message me. Um, all right, day three. I'm out of here. Hola. Well, hola is a little hello. See, I'm all confused. <laughs> I'm all confused, but bye. A10, Flint, Michigan.